What's going on, everybody? DT Fang back with another episode of American Truck Simulator. Today, we are in Montana. That's right. It finally came out. We've been waiting for this one a long time. If you've been watching any of our videos, that you know that we were really excited about this. So, And guys, if you like today's video, make sure you give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. I would appreciate it. So let's check in with Jake, get the job, and get on down the road. Take a look at this beautiful state. Well, all right, Fang, what do you say? We are up here in Montana. Yes, we and, are. I uh, cannot believe it. Finally, finally, finally. <laughs> yeah, it has been quite the ride to get here. But we're finally in Montana. Finally get to do some exploring and see what we think of the state. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited to get, get a job and get on underway. Now, I think today's job, we're actually picking up something that is going to be new. Correct? Oh, wait. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. We are going to be... Calling some dumpsters today over to Sydney, which is uh, unfortunately the opposite direction of where I would like to go, but you know, all in due time. This is probably going right. to be at the time of this recording, it is just about the weekend here, so I'm sure we're going to be trucking a lot over the weekend. Oh, you know it. We should be picking up right here to the right. Uh, right, I think it's here. I think it's here. All right. Okay. I'm not entirely sure. We're going to find out. Let's pull in. What are you driving today, Fang? Uh, let's see. I think I'm driving the Peterbilt 379, uh, the John uh, Ruga. I am at the wrong location. It's uh, it's right across the street. Oh, it is. Okay. All right. Let me Our, get out of your way. It's the neighbor to this place. All right. Let me get out of your way. Oh! Uh, problem there? Nope. <laughs> Only talk about it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> who put that pole there? <laughs> Honestly. I mean, they, I hit in your defense, that is kind of right out in the middle. Of, yeah. what, and why are there logs I behind know. it? I know. I know. That's what messed with me, dude. Yeah, Montana. You know, practically North Dakota. I heard right. they like. I heard that they like it when you say that. Yep, yep. No rivalry yeah. there at all. No, no. And I also heard that I said every single city correctly. No issues. Not even a single one. Fan. No, no, not at all. You are like the yeah. dictionary when it comes to state names. Yeah. Bang! All I right. just want you to know that my first run I ever did in Montana, I ran into another semi. Did you really? Well, I was looking at a fuel truck, and I was like, man, that would be cool to drive, and then I crashed. <laughs> this is one of the new oh. uh, pickup spots, so this is going to be... Uh, it's a pull-through if you go the right way. Okay. Makes sense. Makes sense. Go on the back side of the trailers when you get to that lot, and you can do a pull-through. Okay. It's a fun little drive just driving around the lot, though. Yeah. It's something fun about trying to maneuver a, uh, like a, I would love to have a big warehouse. We have to actually go find the spot. Like it's in this massive, just sea of trailers. Right. That would be so cool. Yeah, it would. Well, that was almost, uh, hurt near, hurt near, you know, we're, it's not perfectly straight, but we're going to take it just so we can get on the road and look at some of this state. Hey, all right, let me turn hey. the old engine off there. Oh, look at there. We got our waste management uh, dumpsters all loaded up, ready to go. Let me get out of your way here. We'll get on down the road. Oh, wow. They're heavy. Are they? Yeah, believe it or not. Are they full? What the heck? I, I hope not. All right. We're all loaded up. I'm going to fire up the engine, roll up the window, and... Uh... At least that parking break. I think we're about ready to roll here, Fang. Well, we've got about a 207 mile journey here today. Slated to take about three hours, 45 minutes. We should still have plenty of daylight. Oh, yeah. We should be just fine. All right. You behind me there? Um, Kind of. Kind of? Sort of? Almost? Yeah. I'm going to have to redo this turn because I forget right. that I have a nose now. Right. So there we go. Fixer. Going to stare at the fuel truck that caused me to wreck last time. Yep, yep. And uh, we're on our way. All right, here we go. And we're getting on the highway. Okay. We're going under the bridge, then left turn. 
So the delivery today is going to uh, be delivered to the, I believe, to the waste uh, management facility, which is a neat little area. And you'll see, if you haven't seen it yet, you'll get to see what that looks like when we get there. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, I delivered one yesterday to the same area. I delivered some, uh, I think it's waste paper, which is also another new cargo that's available. And that one went there too, so. Kinda cool seeing new, new places. Oh yeah, that's part of the fun of uh, having a new state. Not only that you get to drive in just a new state, but you also get some new deliveries, some new drop-off and pick-up locations. You get to see how SES is evolving their world to be more unique per state and, you know, per drop-off, making them a little bit different. Right, exactly. Uh, like, in the very beginning of this game, you know, California, Nevada, even Arizona, and so on, all the buildings, all the assets, very, very copy-pasted. The layout, you know, the facilities were the same thing, just in different cities, right, different yeah. locations. And as they've progressed in making their game, we see that it's far more um, dynamic now. There's a lot more differences. Yeah, oh, trucks, 70 miles an hour. Look at there. Uh, I can tell you right now, I ain't getting up to 70 miles an hour. <laughs> I'm going 57. Let's go. To, let's set her at 60 and just uh, and cruise see on down how the road. Goes from there. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm just cruising in seven high. Didn't have to shift through that whole entire hill. Now that we're at the top of it, go ahead and put her in eight high. Last year, cruising, just sipping that fuel ever so slightly. Okay. Now this is, like I said, dri driving yesterday. I enjoyed it, but this is the first area that I've seen that actually does look different. It looks different than the stuff we've already seen. I don't know, something about these yeah. trees, the spacing, and the... I don't know, it just looks, feel it feels different, which is pretty cool. So, yeah, you've probably driven a lot in... I know you said you were in uh, western Montana, which is going to be very similar to that of, like, Idaho. Right. Um, I know people get so upset when you say these sort of things, but that's just how geography works. <laughs> right. It's nothing to do with your state lines. It's just how the geography works. If it's next to it, it's going to be similar. Yeah, the more east we go, the more, I would say, uh, at this point, the more kind of Great Plains we're getting into, the more, you know, closer to Midwest we're getting into. So we're going to start to see those kind of assets a little bit more prominently. I think this will be a cool area, too, to, you know, add, like, the snow mod once that gets updated for oh, this yeah. new release and everything. That'll be that'll be interesting. Oh, the other thing that I meant to bring up is the way stations are different now. Yes, yes they are. It feels large, it feels grand. This yes, is truly big sky country. Yep, it does. I mean, just look ahead of you. All you see is sky. Yep. Not many mountains creeping up through there. Not to say it's Not flat either. Uh, yep, yeah, no. like yeah, like you were saying, they just you can like right up ahead here. You can totally tell where they just cut right through this little mountain. I always say that SES often releases a new state and it becomes my favorite state. Right. And I have a feeling that'll probably be the case with Montana as well. Probably um, so. But so far, I'm fairly happy with how this state is. Really what I'm most happy for is that having this state out of the way means we're going to get taxes soon, which Texas is really nice. That's a huge state to have. Right. Um, I'll be surprised also... if we get it this year, to be honest. I, I don't. I, yeah. If I had to guess, I don't think it'll be this year. I would guess probably maybe even into March of next year. That's, that's yeah. my prediction. I don't know. I hope I'm wrong. I hope we get it before Christmas, but I don't think we will. An interesting tidbit here is that the Montana DLC was the top DLC seller on all of Steam um, the day it released here, uh, oh, wow. which was just a few days ago for us. So Thursday nope, the 4th. That's right. That's right. Yep. Of, of April. <laughs> of April. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. Yep. Wyoming comes out. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Everybody will know that we're not feeling good if we don't make reference to that at least once in some most of these videos. <laughs> Yeah, come on around me there. You're good. All right, buckaroo. We'll do. You just let me know when I'm around you. All right, you're clear. Come on over. Copy that. Oh, look at this there oil facility over here on the right. That's pretty. 
Yeah. Pretty cool. For tonight, got the train tracks running in there. Yep. One mile to something in Sydney. So we're coming up on an exit up here. Wind dive. I don't know if it's our exit, but it is a exit. Sure is, buddy. Alrighty, I'll start uh, turning on the blinky blinky. Yeah. Start slowing I'm her down. Revving this thing out, trying to get slowed down here. You know, you're hauling butt when you can't even get slowed down with your engine brake. Yep. Wow, okay. Well, like I said in the beginning, these weigh more than you think they do. Yeah, it's a little deceiving, isn't it? Yeah, it is, because I think they're steel, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that would make sense. True. This is a neat little area. It is. It is. It's very neat. Got a little, There's a road uh, paver right on the right there. Yeah, yeah, I see it. Dude had an ATV on the left. MHP. Oh, there's a little bit of water right there to the left. It's like a, uh, I don't know if it's like a... Oh, yeah, a little pond. Little pond or, oh, there's lake. a dinosaur. What? There's a dinosaur to the left. Like, on a statue podium thing, there was a dinosaur. Okay, I totally missed that. Guys, go back and leave a comment down below what the timestamp is on that dinosaur that I missed, if I even saw it. If it was in my screen, because I swear I missed it. Oh, look at this little <laughs> rail yard over here. Yeah. That's cool. Very cool. I don't know, man. I'm quite liking the vibe out here in, in uh, eastern Montana. Yeah, I'm kind of glad we did this drive today, because now I'm, I'm starting to see some differences that I just had not seen yesterday. Having grown up in the Midwest, I really, really look forward to being able to just haul anything more agriculture related around oh, the Midwest. Got a way station that I've got to pull into. Um, so do I, but I don't know how. Okay, it is uh, go the roundabout to the right. You missed it. I missed it. Yep. I need to come back, back here. Just okay. go all the way back around and follow okay. me. Okay. I think. That's the good thing about roundabouts. Yep. My okay, God. yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. There we go. Okay, I see it now. Oh, we gotta turn around and Oh wait, what? Alright, this is not making any sense to me. Way station to the right. Okay. We gotta turn all the way around here. Oh, this is weird. This is a weird one. Good lord. The way it's Are not... you sure we had to enter I this way? Maybe... Yeah, because here's the this is the little thing, the where no, the guys are standing. Dang. Maybe not. Did I do it There's backwards? There's a road right behind you. you. Got an exit sign. It's the way out. Uh, well, I was just following the sign that I saw that said go to the right, and then it said go to the right again. We'll make it work. Here, I'll come out to you. I'll cross in front of you here. Yep. All right. 89,000 pounds, boss. Wow. Let's see. I told you they were heavier than you think. 89,000 yep. pounds. You know what I've noticed? I've noticed a lot of these little roundabouts with the way stations. Uh, the, when you, Cap, and I were driving, uh, we hit one of these. I only got four miles left, so. I'm going to stick right on the inside, just enough to bother you. All right. Hey, Jake, I don't want to alarm you, but we've driven all the way to Australia. My lord. Uh-oh. 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 What? Right lane ends. I don't believe in an out Burger is in Montana. I'm just going to call that one out. I am almost certain. I'm 99.999% positive there is no in and out Burger in <laughs> Montana. All right. Well, you know, this we are using mods in SCS's okay. defense. This they they I'm not calling out there. SCS here. I'm just saying we need it uh, needs to get updated. This is a really neat little town here. This feels Authentic. It does. They're, they're, they're doing authentic. a lot more to the detail of the towns. Yes. The towns have been amazing to look at so far. What were you saying you saw? On, like There was like something on the table the other day. Oh, like you drove by. Good Lord. Yeah, there was tables out front on the, on the sidewalk. And there were coffee cups on the tables on the sidewalk. Wow. I mean, just detail beyond detail. It was, it was insane. That's pretty cool. All right, well, evidently, not only does the Home Depot-type store sell notebook paper, cat food, evidently they sell dumpsters, too. Yeah, yeah. Hey, got you new dumpsters here. Where you want her? 
Appreciate it, strange man. Oh, I got the law fixing here, bud. Law fixing. All kinds of fixings. All right, Fang, I got mine taken off, and uh, it's time for them to unload you. That's a successful hold here today. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, it is. Well, guys, that's going to do it for another video. Make sure if you like today's video, you give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. I would appreciate it. Special thanks to the Formal Pickle for this run and SCS for finally releasing Montana. Thank you guys very much. Until next time, DT Fang, we'll see you on the next one. See ya!